Piers Morgan has gone from good morning Britain to good evening no one on talk TV funded by Rupert Murdoch to the tune of scores of millions of pounds. Piers Morgan's wages alone are 50 million pounds and hardly anyone is watching. Tom Newton Dunn, formerly the guru of the biggest selling as was British newspaper The Sun, spent 45 minutes on his show last week talking to absolutely no one, not a single viewer. Why do I mention it? Well, you'll discover that in just a few minutes. It's been one hell of a bad week. In fact, weekend for the British establishment. And they're recycling Viagra. You want to know more? Stay tuned because this is the mother of all talk shows. It is the College of Knowledge. There are no tuition fees and you are positively encouraged to speak back to the teacher. From all over the Anglosphere, we are expecting your calls and we are deeply grateful for you being part of our audience. We're talking British politics, American politics. We're talking Ukraine and Russia. We're talking China, where the 20th Congress of the Chinese ruling party, the Communist Party of China, is well underway and where some pretty startling events have already taken place. And we'll be talking about the collapse of the British government. I've got a poll running. Will Liz Truss be removed by Halloween or by Guy Fox night? I know there's only a few days between those two, but it's looking like, to me, she won't even make the Halloween. Get voting on that poll if you want your opinion to count. What happened to the Tories, formerly the most efficient political party in the entire world? How did they end up? Trust up like a turkey. Fasten your seatbelts. This is the mother of all talk shows.